These are the final tins in the Crown Zenith collection. Crown Zenith is known for its high pull rates and absolutely stunning cards. So today we're going to be opening up three of these tins, one for each legendary bird, Motres, Articuno and Zapdos. So let's kick it off with Articuno, otherwise known as the Frozone bird. Each of these tins contains five Crown Zenith packs and the beautiful artwork you're seeing right here. Get this plastic out of here, undress this lovely tin. Let's open her up. Oh, here we have this beautiful Frozone looking card. Oh Christ. And here is a code for any of you who want to use it. I'm just, I'm just a generous person. Here we have it. Look at that card. We've got our five packs here. Crown Zenith packs as well. They just look nice. And it is doing millions for my serotonin levels. Let's get into the first pack. Now, as you can see here, my real struggle to open these cards is a day-to-day -day problem, but I do have a trick or two up my sleeve. So what I like to do when I open these is guess the energy. So play along with me, guys. Comment down below how many you get right. So let's start off strong. I'm going to go for water. <gasps> now, haters will say that's fake, but genuinely, that was a guess. I'm very happy with that one. Gosh, that's poor. This is the money right here. Pawniard, <laughs> Whelmer, Pokeball. Oh! Off the star, let's go. We got a Dunsparce and we get a Nessa. Now, they tricked me the first time I saw one of these cards. I thought this was actually signed by the, I don't know, the voice actor, but <laughs> little old me had no idea what the devil I was talking about. We're off to a great start, to be honest. You know what we're going to do with this, though? Sleeve it. I'm actually holding on to these standard cards because I decided, after opening way too many packs of the Crown Zenith Connection, that I was, in fact, going to collect all of the Crown Zenith cards and try my best to complete the collection. One, two, three, four. Now I'm gonna go electricity this time. You guys tell me what you think. Oh, it is dark. Salazzle, Carnivine, Pokeball, Shrilp. This little little man, we've got the Panda, Switchingtons. Hey, and a very nice Taurus. And for the rare, we have a Whale Lord. You know, whales have the largest penis in the whole of the mammal kind. In all of the world, I think. They actually have the award for largest dog. Anyway, enough about whale penises. We'll move on. Fun fact, in the ancient mythology, you know, they always had those big sea monsters that came out and about. They were like, oh, I wonder what those crazy sea monsters are. Well, they were just whale dicks. All right. Electricity. I forgot to do it against myself. Got Luxio, Ultra Ball, Electric. Just reminds me of Eel Rob Ruff, he do be looking cute. Tangella, a bull time. We've got the old Meowth. Energy Retrieval, I haven't seen one of those yet, but I know that's not that rare. And we have a Bede, or Bead, or something along those lines, but we have the old Bede. And a Rotom V, how delightful. So not bad, we've got two light sleeves, as I like to call them. I would obviously love to get couple hard sleeves of this video. We just gotta hope and pray. But what we can do, one thing we definitely can do, you see this Pikachu right here? You see this one right here, this boy? Rub his head for luck, but nothing weird. Just, just a little bit, just to see. Jesus Christ. Stupid bastard backs. This is exactly why I can never do a stream, because I'm gonna spend most of it just trying, God damn it. Nope. Here we go, we're in, finally. We're gonna go with fire. It is fighting. Yeah, I don't know if you guys have actually played the TCG online game, but it is a lot of fun and you do get to open more packs. So a pack fiend such as myself can, you know, get the serotonin boost that I need to survive on a day-to-day -day basis. And we have a lovely chatot or chateau as the French would say. And for our rare, well, we have a Volcarana. A, vol a Volcarona. Let's move on to the final pack of the first tin. Look at that, open that up 10 times quicker than the last one. I need you to be extra juicy for me. I'm gonna go for grass. I haven't seen grass yet, but it is fire. That's what I predicted last time. How many of you guys got right so far? I do wonder. We move on to gloom, crushing hammer, the old electric bastard. We've got a bit of a sheep, a sphinx. I mean a shinx, I say it wrong every time. A panda, a little cone. Oh, okay. Now that is a beautiful card, incredible. And we have the rare behind it, I don't even care about you, but goodness me, that is stunning. See, I knew rubbing that Pikachu for good luck was the move. Bang, 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 thank you Pikachu for the luck. And as with most genies, you can only rub him three times a day. Not bad for the first tin. Obviously we've had this card come with it. We got a nice little Dunsparce, a Rotom V, and then to top it all off, 
Wow. It looks pretty clean as well on the back. I'm no PSA expert, so we'll have to wait and see. Very happy with that. Make sure you stay to the end of the video because I'll be opening a fourth 10 and I will be giving away that card to one of you guys. So make sure you're subscribed. Check the link down below for where to enter for the giveaway. We'll move on to our next one, the Zapdos tin. Carefully. Oh, beautiful. And here we have it. Let's open up this beautiful Zapdos. Wow. Now here we have the Zapdos chasing this poor Pokemon as it runs for its life. The Dodo Dodorito, the double-headed Dodo. Also, there is a lovely code for one of you at home. As per the last one, we get five packs. So let's see if this tin is in fact better than the last. On to the first of five. In we go, straight away. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I'm super excited for the new Scarlet and Violet base set. So we're gonna go for Fire. Wrong. But yeah, I'm super gassed for the new set. I've pre-ordered a lot of boxes, so there'll be a lot of content coming up. We're gonna be opening a whole case, which I'm super excited for. Just got a lot of good content coming up. Oh, so starting off nicely with a Luxio and, oh, a Mew V. Now I do like the Mew cards. Look at the cute little bugger. He's just begging for a sleep. He's just like, sleep me daddy. And I will do as you command. On to our second pack. Now, oh, another quick open, we love to see it. Okay, one, two, three, four. Now, I'm gonna go for mm, a bit of fire in the booth this time. Oh, it is dark, dark, dark. Not what you want. But yeah, I'm super excited there's new sets coming out, like scheduled for June the 1st, like Paldea, I believe it's called. I'm gassed for that. Oh, Keldeo alternate art. Look at those northern lights straight from bloody Iceland or somewhere cold and beautiful. Wow. What a card. That is gorgeous. <laughs> Rayquaza VMAX. These tins are insane. Two gorgeous cards, one after another. The Zapdos is already competing for best tin. Some pretty tasty pulls from just two packs. You really can't complain. Both cards that I've never packed from Crown Zenith before, and I've opened a good amount onto the third. So for Zapdos, the old electric. I swear it used to be yellow, but apparently it's now orange. So maybe I had to change of color, change of hat. But electricity is my guess. Unfortunately not, it is water. Uh, and we move on. Now, I don't know about you guys, but the the pulls, the pull rate on this bloody set has been magnificent. There's just been... I'm literally speaking it into existence. The Hatterini. Hatteren. Hatterini. Goodness gracious me. Another gorgeous card. And we have a Skyle Seal Stone as well. This set has just been... Magnificent. Another soft sleeve for you. Get in there, be safe. Depending on what we get in these next two packs, we could actually have a better tin than the Articuno. Two more packs. I'm feeling a little rubber Pikachu. Now, we've only got one more left after this, so can't be wasting this. Rip it open straight away. What are your guesses, ladies and gentlemen? I'm gonna go for Psychic. Feeling a bit of Psychic energy, but I'm wrong. <laughs> Ridiculously wrong, it was fighting. We have Lunatone, Udish. Salandit. Yeah, as you as you will become quickly aware, I cannot pronounce. Oh. Ah, I don't believe it! Holy f I don't need to pronounce this because this pronounced dub. A big fat W. Holy shit. Wow. I've been looking for this card. This card is ridiculous. That is in Okay, goodbye. Wow. Zapdos, you've only gone and beaten your rival Articuno. You see what I mean? Use that Pikachu for good luck. That's what I'm saying. All right, we've got one more pack. I really, I'm not going to be too upset if I don't pull anything here because we have pulled some insanity so far. I'm feeling, feeling water. Electricity. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Digging duo. We've got the old porcupines. Couple of energy switches. Ryulu and our hollow it. Another alt art. Toxitricity. Maximum downer. Wow. That's like me on a hangover. That is another gorgeous cat. I can't complain. And then we've got a Bede. Wow. I've said wow so many times this video because I am nothing but impressed. Get yourself in that soft sleeve, my gorgeous child. Here we have it. Everything we got from the Zapdos tin. It did way better than the Articuno. I am, again, gobsmacked. You see that little bit of shake there? Wow. I just, I can't begin to express how excited I am by these tins. The Crown Zenith packs are just juiced, brimming to the brim with juice. Now we move on to the third and final of the bird tins, the Moltres. Arguably the sexiest looking card of the three to see if they have the sexiest packs. 
of the three. Unbox this beauty right here. Okay then. Come on, darling. Get out of there. The Moltres. Gorgeous card, honestly. And here is the code for you watching at home. I have recently been doing a lot of research and obviously looking at the Japanese cards with their silver borders, which we are getting in the new Scarlet and Violet set. Okay, so five packs. Let's see if Moltres can take it home today. It's going to be a tough one to be. I'm not going to lie to you. The, the heat we've pulled so far has been ridiculous. Remember, we've got one more lucky Pikachu rub. Now, we might have to use that on our final tin. Started off, we got the dark energy. I forgot to guess, but it doesn't matter. We're moving on. Got the Great Ball, the Bishop, the Bidoof, a little Lizard Man, the Cat and the Bug. Pardon me, you get a little burp in there thrown in for extra. And we have the double, a fluffy sheep. I don't know, I dropped it, but here we go. Enormous. Enormous. Otherwise known as Big Boy. Now, that was probably the first dud we've had in a while. I'm so used to packing absolute heat in that last tin that that one felt like a real letdown. But, you know, you move. So let's get ourselves into the second pack. It is not over, ladies and gentlemen. It is far from over. Oh, oh, that is not good. Look at that card there. We're gonna go for water. That is grass. Grass, grass, grass. Here we go. Now we're gonna kick it off with some speed. Now, I'm super excited for the fact that we can have a chance of having three shinies in the next Scarlet and Violet set. Oh, the sweet queen bee. Wow, another gorgeous card. Just when you think it couldn't get better, it does. And a gum shoes. <laughs> another heart case for another beautiful card. I'm lost here. This is insane. If I was simply ripping these packs just to resell them, I would have absolutely made all my money back plus more. Here we go. Four cards. Unfortunately, we can't play the guessing game this time. We've got the old V Star. V Star, V Star. All right. Electric. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I wish there was more Charizards in this set. Obviously, there are three potentials, but I really just want to. Ooh! Radiant Eternatus. Yeah, I just really want to pull a nice Charizard card because I like Charizard cards. And growing up, Charmander was my favorite Pokemon, Shock Horror. I grew up in the age, born in 1995. All right, we're gonna go for Electricity. Okay, off to a lovely, fantastic start. I've only really just got into Pokemon card collecting recently, went to Utah, I had nothing to do there, so decided to buy some packs and lo and behold, thousands of dollars later, here we are. And a lovely Ryulu alternate art. Look at that, what a cutie. Followed by a Rayhan Hollow. We're gonna go for Water. It is fighting. It's crazy to see just how popular the Pokemon cards have been coming over recent years. Obviously, Logan Paul did his crazy stuff with pack openings of the Shadowless sets. It's it's insane. I really wish I held on to some Pokemon cards when I was younger because I definitely had some, but definitely ended up in the bin. This one didn't have as many pulls as the last one, but it definitely had the best pull so far. This gorgeous, so clean. But yeah, let's move on to the final 10. Now we got one Pikachu rub remaining. So we might get lucky here. As I mentioned at the start of the video, I will be giving away this card to one of you lucky guys down below. All you gotta do is subscribe, drop a comment, and follow the link in the description. I'll be doing a giveaway on Twitter so that you guys can join in. On top of that, because I'm such a nice guy, I'm gonna throw in a hard case for this gorgeous card so that you'll receive it in one piece. Also, Daisy Cat. Then we got five packs in here. I'm feeling the lucky Pikachu rub. You know, it's my last one. Gotta use it. First of five. Ah, oh, I can see a little orange in there. Shrubby boy. Here is your code. One, two, three, four. Let's start off to a strong start. Fire. Oh, it is fire. Totally didn't ruin any of the cards back there, but we got the fire. Fantastic start. I don't even know if we'll be able to pull anything crazier than we've already done, but there's always hope. There's always that legendary. Oh, Grant. He's got a pear or some kind of strange fruit. He will definitely go for a pretty penny. And oh, look at that cutie. Greedent V. There's a little freaking cheeks. You know punch him in the face. Unfortunately, I don't think it's worth a hard sleeve, but a great pull nonetheless. Look at this little chubby monster in this soft sleeve as well. Aren't you a good boy? I'm feeling that Pikachu luck already rubbing off. Excuse the perm. I've also ordered two boxes of the Triple Beat, which is the first expansion of Scarlet and Violet, but for the Japanese version. So I'm excited for those to come and I'll be doing a pack opening here. So let's go for water. Wrong fighting. Got the friends. 
Got Carnival. Now, I'm still looking for that Charizard. Can we pull a Charizard V-Star before the end of the video? I will be a very happy gentleman. Oh, now this, strangely enough, is the first time I've pulled a shiny energy card. I've not done that yet in all the packs I've opened. I've definitely opened more than 100 to 200 probably, maybe 300 packs so far in my life. But I've never pulled a shiny energy. Well, there you go, first for everything. And a gum shoes. Moving on to our third pack. As you can see, we're back again, struggling with to open it, which means there must be something zesty inside. Here we have the code. Electric. I forget to guess sometimes. Even I forget to guess. All right, we're going in. I think we've guessed two right so far out of all these packs and out of the ones I remembered, but you know, we'll take it, we'll take it. Oh, and we've got another Dunsparce. You know what? I'm gonna throw this one into the giveaway as well. So I'll be sending this card along with this Dunsparce to one of you lucky viewers. And we're finishing off with the rare Bellossom. Onto the penultimate pack. I'm feeling, feeling good. This one's feeling zesty to me. Got your code. One, two, three, four. Let's go for fire in the booth because we're about to pull some grass. Uh, moving on, it's got the Metang, Shamans, Hyper, and Molga. Now, what will our hollow be this time? Oh, digging duo, mining for things and stuff, and a Perserker as our rare. We really need something out of this final pack because so far we have not pulled the greatest. Obviously, we got this sweet Grant card, chubby little boy, energy, and the dunce best. Final pack. There is your code. In before I redeem them all, before this content is even out to the public. And we have Psychic. Oh, we got that Psychic Energy right there for the final pack. Kicking it off with the Lost Vacuum. Where did the vacuum go? I don't know. I bloody lost it. Fantastic joke. We got the Panda. This old knifey bastard. Spaghetti Noodles and a Crushing Hammer. And the final card. Bit disappointing that one, but a 10's a 10. Can we just take a moment to appreciate the heat we pulled today? Articuno tin, Zapdos tin, Frickian Moltres tin. I think mean, the, the Moltres here might have to take it home, but this one has so much good stuff in it as well. Very, very happy boy. Now, if you want to see more content, make sure you drop a like down below, subscribe to the channel, and make sure you enter the giveaway. Don't miss out. It's been your boy Rizzle. Peace.